Welcome to the figure zone. Today I've got another third party, one six scale figure and head sculpt and costume set preview video for you today. Now again, these are third party companies making these, so they don't own the rights to produce these figures. They're mostly making them for us to buy and we're liking them because we want to buy them. So a lot of the big companies generally don't make these obscure characters. Either they feel they're going to not sell well or not make up the money they put into it. So they make these figures. If you're cool with that, cool. Not cool with that, cool. Check out my other videos I have also made for some third party figures coming out. Usually you can track these things down online doing a quick search and you can find these cool figures. I'm not being paid by the companies for this video, nor am I being paid by the companies selling these figures for this video. This is just me making this to show people out there that these figures exist, and some of these figures are fracking awesome. Make sure to hit the thumbs up if you're enjoying this video. In the comments below, let me know if you got any of these figures or you pre-ordered any of these figures, because some of these guys are fracking amazing. First up from Super Duck is the SDH032 one six scale female head sculpt in two styles. Now it's a quarter of one of 2022 release and they're around 39 to 40 bucks a pop. You get style A, which has long hair and style B, which gets short hair. Now also there's the Super Duck set 070 one six scale combat girl 2.0 costume set. And that's going to be a quarter one of 2022 and it's around 90 bucks. Now, so with the heads, you just get the heads. You can pick either the short hair or the really, really long hair. Now with the costume set, it says it does come with a head sculpt. It looks like it comes with like a medium length haired head sculpt. Now, the one thing about this costume set, of course, is you do not get a body. They're suggesting to use the TB League S10D seamless body for this to make it match the head sculpt and of course this is Tifa Lockhart from Final Fantasy series Up next from AC Play is the ATX053 one six scale gnome killer succuba. <laughs> I love the names they get with these guys. Quarter one of 2022, and it's around 180 bucks. Now, of course, this is the witch from the Goblin Slayer series. Now, with this one, you get the head sculpt, a TB League S10D seamless body. You get four hands. You get the full complete costume with the shoes and the hat, everything pretty much pictured. There are some bracelets I think are in there also. Now you also get the pipe and you get her staff. So looks pretty awesome. Again, they did a great job of making this look like it is from the series. So very cool.
Now AC Play has also made the Sword Maiden figure, and that looks pretty freaking cool. I got that one on pre-order. Again, looks really nice. And it looks like they're going to continue the series. Next up, it looks like the High Elf Archer and the Priestess figure. So that's cool. I'm glad a company's going to make a figure and then kind of continue on with more of the line. Check out my third-party preview of the Sword Maiden figure. Now from TH Toys is the A001DX 1-6 scale gangster figure deluxe and regular versions. Now the deluxe is a quarter one of 2022 and it's gonna run 275. The regular version is a quarter one 2022 and it's only 175. The difference between the figures is you get the horse Grace's Secret and with the reins and the saddle. That's pretty much the only difference. And that's pretty freaking sweet price, 275 for a figure plus a horse. I'm sure it's just a hollow piece of plastic, but still, that's freaking sweet. Now, of course, this is Tommy Shelby from the Peaky Blinders TV series. Now, with this set, of course, each one comes with the figure. You get the head, the body, 12 hands, full costume with the jackets, hat. You get a pocket watch, and you get a cigarette, which looks pretty freaking sweet, too. Now you know he's going to come with some extra weapon accessories here. You get his cool Tommy gun. You also get his Webley 455 revolver. And you also get his Colt M1911 pistol. So you do get some cool weapons with these. These are the three guns he mostly uses during the season so far. I've never watched the complete seasons. I've watched the first two episodes or three and it's just... It's, uh, it's It seems pretty cool. i got to get more into it as we go along, see how it goes. Now, what happens sometimes when these third-party companies release figures, they try to get them out kind of quick because sometimes companies are making officially licensed figures. From the company Big Chief, again, they've got officially licensed figures of Tommy and Arthur Shelby coming out. And these pretty much can be bought almost every single website you can think of that sells action figures. It's really up to you which ones you like best. If you want to get some officially licensed ones, cool, we'll grab those. And if the third party ones start making some secondary characters, grab a couple from the third party. But if you want that horse, most likely you're going to have to go third party there. Thanks so much for watching. Hit that thumbs up if you're enjoying the video. Hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. If you want to be notified when a video goes live, hit the bell notification. Again, thanks again. Until the next video.